he's gone to Silvani, although he may well just be playing the extra sweeper. Well, that wasn't meant from Barlow. Straight to Watson on cue. This will put his mind in a good spot if he slots this for the opener. And that was never in doubt. Melbourne on the board. Maybe waited too long. Daniel Pierce on the rebound. Perfect pass and opportunity here for Hannah. Therein lies why this club are uh, at the top end of the ladder. That was just incredibly good defence, and they just continue to go while Melbourne sleep. This time, they're content, the fans. They're content with their start after watching the first one against them. Ball to the back, McKenzie, stolen by Sutcliffe, almost leg. The ball squeezes it short, main, and you can almost put this in the book. That's how good he is here. He's normally automatic. Two in a row in the early parts, their effort hasn't been anywhere near what they oh, showed last week. Five to Boer, Maine, and now Hanif. He drives it long. This is a clinic. This Sutcliffe all having an impact for Fremantle today. Five knocks it down. He's Crozier on cue. Spins around the body and pulls a rabbit from his hat. Sutcliffe short. Mains, but Daniel Pierce, and he's on the left. That's his forte. Oh, Melbourne have got to avoid being lacked here. Hamble terrible. Sutcliffe squeezes it to Ballantyne. Splendid hands. Again, for 10 goals in a row to Fremantle. And they plan on sending Melbourne to an early grave today. Nathan Jones having a good five minutes here, the Demons. Bit of scoreboard uh, reward required. And they might just get it. That wasn't quite a mark, but it's probably a free. Advantage paid. Trengove kicks the goal against the flow to break a run of 10 goals in a row. It was a big contest from Jeremy Howe. Ballantyne was involved in that as well, but Jeremy Howe with a big leap here. Ballantyne coming back and gets under his legs. And it was a big contest from Jeremy Howe. Ballantyne was involved in that as well, but. Jeremy Howe with a big leap here. Ballantyne coming back and gets under his legs. And Silvani might be reported here. He is. So Silvani has been reported for this. It wasn't a high bump. There's too much jogging going on behind the ball when players aren't in their absolute zones. And that's the sort of uh, stuff that will create an absolute debacle. Mzungu finds space and again Crozier sits in the hole. And pressure on the kick. A a lot quicker. Never missed a shot in his life, Hayden Crozier. Six <laughs> goals straight before that kick, and he's now got seven straight for his career. Burns off Burns, heads to Spur. Straight through the hands of a couple. Still alive for the Demons. Tap Scott to Howe. Doesn't want to shoot. Shrugs a tackle. Now shoots and gives them a rare highlight. He's already spent from the big run. To the hot spot. House down there. Well, only he could have marked that running back with the flight. Should kick this and give Melbourne even more incentive to keep running. Barlow shoots it back. Pierce on the left has a crack. Oh, Magnificent. Touch. I think we may be going to review because... I, I, I believe it might have been touched yeah. yeah, here. I think it flicked a finger as well, yeah. Okay, so Ron Bale on. Neville Jeddah, the Swan District's boy back home is off, and that's a 50 they can ill afford. Melbourne's incompetence and Fremantle's dominance from the outset. Now they're being stunned by this Melbourne performance. Daniel Pierce, and that was a stunning shot from outside 50. Doors long over the head of Gorn. So Trent goes free, high contact. They're getting some breaks. But, uh, Work efficiency and 100% work rate. And right now, Melbourne are winning the quarter. And Sutcliffe peels for him. He took off before anybody else knew he slipped out the side. Ballantyne on the march. Great, got it. Great mark. Friend to have a massive afternoon, Hayden Ballantyne. He's got 2 3 to his name. Make that 3 3. And on that occasion, he went, Jono, but he only went when it was already uh, done. A done deal. Ibbotson, well, he came into this game as the number one intercept possession player in the competition. From just outside 50, gee, well, distance not a problem. Absolutely superb. Floats one over the head. Little flick was good from Sutcliffe. De Boer 
Shrugs the tackle from Evans. Centering kick. Mazungu plucks it, plays on, drills it. 